Hello everybody and welcome back to another Wuthering Ways video. In today's video we have got some Shorekeeper and Yohu leaks. Uh, we have a leak on the Shorekeeper's Convene animation, Yohu's Resonance, uh, Yohu's Resonance Liberation animation, and we also have some gameplay trailers for each of the characters which I'm going to be showing you in today's video. So let's get straight into it. First of all, we're going to look at the Shorekeeper Convene animation. Okay, this is the Shellkeeper Convene animation. Okay, as her butterfly. Honestly, she is she's such a pretty character, I'm not gonna argue with you. And it's crazy that she's not she's not um Glacio, but look at her character. Like I, it's weird that they made her Spectra with this kind of design, but it's it is it is what it is. But she's such a stunning character that was a really nice animation. We have a Yohu one. Now it says this is a Resus Liberation um animation, and I noticed this. I don't know if this is the Resus Liberation or not, but I if it is, I'm I don't know what this could be. A W D and S. Like you have to press each you have to press them all the same time. I have no idea, but if that's a Resus Liberation, that should be interesting. Let's move on to some um gameplay of both of them. Okay, here is some uh, gameplay of the shorekeeper. Let's watch this. Okay, that's the walking animation. Okay, those are the basic attacks, which by the way, look amazing. That was just a skill. Ah, this is the, the butterfly that she can turn into as well. And I believe that little light thing was the cocoon there. That honestly, I thought Zeshi's attacks were like really pretty, and that's kind of one of the main reasons I went for. But the shortkeeper, oh my goodness, um, her attacks look amazing, and uh, as you saw at the end, that uh, that's like the AOE where we have the three instances, and again we can upgrade this over and over again. And I believe this like here is the cocoon that she makes when she gets out of butterfly form. As you notice, when she went in butterfly form, this turned blue. And she kind of went around in a circle, came out, and then this light appeared. So that's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. She looks amazing. Expected. Let's check out Yohu now. Okay, let's look at Yohu, see what she has to offer. Okay, so she's gauntless. I'm pretty sure we, we knew this from before. Nice, nice. Okay. What about, yeah, this is what I want to see. What is that? What? This is a four star, by the way, guys. That was interesting. Okay. So from... Now, this is just a guess from me. I believe what these are, they are different buffs. So I believe she's a support. And each of these will provide your team with a different buff. Um, you obviously pick one of the four. Uh, this one, they picked A. And this little thing here, it stops at the one you picked. And I'm guessing it gives that buff, according to what the buff was, it gives that to your team. That's honestly pretty cool. Like, that's a very interesting um, thing for a four star. Um, I like it a lot. And I, I remember in the past league, we were talking about how there's a jackpot kind of thing as well. Um, it kind of seems like that's what this is. It's like the jackpot system. So honestly, I'm excited for it. This should be really cool. There is one more video of the shorekeeper actually hitting an enemy. So let's check that out real quick. All right, let's get into this. I mean, like, those attacks look so amazing. For a healer, she looks insane. I mean, she's a healer and buffer. Wow. Wow. I mean, you even saw here, like, she went up into the sky. That aerial attack was so cool. Wow. Honestly, she looks amazing. And, um, yeah, that is gameplay trailer of both of them. And honestly, from what I just saw, I want both of them. Even though Yohu's a four star, and a lot of people kind of don't really care much about four stars. Like, obviously, a lot of people are just like, oh, five stars, I want this. And but she actually looks like she can be really good. Uh, Yo, who can be really good for any team. Um, and she definitely looks like she can provide you with a, a lot of good buffs. 
So I think I might actually, I actually might want her as well. I also do want Shorekeeper and I'm praying. Um, obviously I got Zeshi, so I'm on, I am on a 50-50 now, but I'm praying when she comes around that I win my 50 because I really do want Shorekeeper. She, she does look amazing. But that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.